Hello, 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 everybody. Terry Lidge here from the CTFO CBD Talk Live here, guys. How's everybody doing tonight? <clears throat> We're coming upon 7 o'clock Eastern time here in New York. So, you know... We're going to let this room fill up a little bit, guys, and um, we're talking about arthritis tonight, guys. We're talking about arthritis and how it affects people and some of the symptoms, you know, we're going to go through a little bit tonight and, you know, what, what, what we can do to try to relieve our symptoms we're going to talk about also, you know, so we're going to let a few more people come on into the room. I hope you guys enjoy. As we always do, CBD Talk Live, we're always going to bring you guys something positive about our daily issues that people deal with in everyday life, guys. We're not doctors, guys. I'm going to repeat, we're not doctors. We're not making any claims of being cured or anything, okay? We're talking about arthritis, what people deal with it, some of the symptoms that people can go through, and so forth. We're not making any claims um, of our product that we have at the end. You know, it may help you. You know, we're trying to get this out here where we can get the product in the hands of people that need help. You know, um, if you've got arthritis, we talked a lot about a lot of different um, issues over the last couple weeks. You know, um, you can pick those right up in the CBD Talk Live, those videos, if you want to recap yourselves. You know, but we're going to keep going and we're going to keep talking about the daily ailments that, you know, you know, affect our lives, you know, because it's important, guys, you know, and there is a solution out there. There is a solution out there and it's an all natural supplement too, guys. OK, well, you know, um, we'll talk about that towards the end, but we're going to let this room fill up a little bit more. Like I said, I'm early. I'm always early and um, it's better to be early than late guys okay so we're gonna wait wait for a few more people to come in you know um timothy how you doing glad you joined timothy yeah we're talking about arthritis tonight that's one of your topics too obviously um i would love to bring you on um Let's talk about it, you know, um, it's a real live testimony that um, everybody, you know, know and hear about, you know, um, don't be shy to talk about your testimony because, you know, it, you know, you get the word out, out there more, you know, Timothy, how you doing? Nice to you join us. Good. How are you? Good, good, good. How's everything going with you? Oh, pretty good. Pretty good. Just going to head home here. I'm going to have my wife drive so I can talk with you guys. Okay, so we'll, we'll, I'll bring you back on when you get home. Well, it takes us like 45 minutes to get home. It's quite a drive. Oh, we'll still be on. We're on for an hour. So, you know, if we can catch you, it'd be a nice little testimony you can give us on, you know, your arthritis, you know, and what you've dealt with, you know what I mean? So, you know, take your time, drive safe, you know, maybe we'll see you on, you know, when you get home. Okay, I'll check back. Okay, definitely. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Um, yeah, so, you know, that that would that, be a good little testimony for everybody to um, come in and, and, and try to get, you know, uh, on board. Okay, we're back here, guys. We're still waiting for people to come on into this room. Still waiting for people to come on in, guys. We're, we're a little early here. Like to let people come on into the room, you know. Um, Timothy Myers Nyer stopped by, you know. He, he's headed home right now, but he's got a little testimony that he 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 like to share with everybody too, you know. So hopefully we can, you know, be on at, at the time that he gets home, you know. It'd be a nice little testimony for everybody to hear, too, on, on, on top of it, you know. Um, but, yeah, we're going to let this room fill up, guys. Um, if you're here, uh, 
give me a thumbs up if you're here, you know, watching, uh, you know, waiting. We'll be starting shortly, guys. We're gonna wait for some more people to come on in. Be right back. All right, guys. All right. How you doing? Everybody doing good, I hope. Back again, five after guys, five after guys. We're going to get this party started, you know. We're going to talk about what is osteoarthritis. Osteoarthritis is a type of arthritis that occurs when the flexible tissue um at the ends of the bones wear down, guys. The flexible tissue at the ends of your bones wear down. That is osteoarthritis. 
What is arthritis? Arthritis is an inflammation of one or more joints causing pain and stiffness that can worsen with age. So, you know, osteo deals with the flexibility flexible tissue at the ends of the bones. Arthritis is an inflammation of one or more joints and they can increase with age, guys. It's good to know, it's good to know. Symptoms, you know, symptoms, you know, a lot of symptoms can include pain and swelling and reduce of range of motion and stiffness, okay? Range of motion, you can't move your wrists, you know, or your fingers, you know, you can't. You know, you know, you lose that range of motion and you get stiffness, you know, in your joints where, you know, you, it, you're you're unable to move those joints, you know, um, pain areas in the joints, ankles, backs, fingers, um, hands, muscles, your neck, it could be in your wrists, like I said, too, you know, the type of pain can be irritable, it can be irritant you know or, or sharp and can occur while sitting you can have decreased range of motion and difficulty walking or muscle weakness and if your joint stiffens tenderness or swelling will will accompany that you know um how many people out here you know have that you know ha have dealt with arthritis anybody out here have dealt with arthritis Has anybody ever dealt with arthritis? Anybody? Has anybody dealt with arthritis out here? Doc, how you doing, Doc? Glad you joined, Doc. Anybody? Anybody's ever dealt with arthritis in their lives? You know, and and had any of the symptoms that um that I talked about just a minute ago, you know, with the lot pain and swelling and the loss of range of motion, you know, um stiffness, you know, anybody just give me a thumbs up if you anybody's ever had any of those symptoms, you know. Um sore joints in your knees, you know, that's that osteoarthritis, you know. Um that flexible tissue in your in the ends of your bones wear down, you know, that osteo, you know, arthritis, you know, that can be very painful. A lot of people, you know, they, they get some people end up getting knee replacements and stuff, you know what I'm saying? And it can be very painful. I've heard a lot of people, you know, in pain over um um you got a few coworkers, Doc. Yes, yes. We we gonna be talking about that doc definitely, man. Um they definitely use that, you know, and you know, um studies showing that a lot more people are, are turning into that. You know, it's a it's a great product to use, you know, but you gotta know the right one to use, you know. Um like I said, it it's a decreased range of motion, difficulty walking or muscle weakness, you know, in your joints. You know what I mean? Um it's, it, you know, joint pain, the type of pain that can vary depending on uh, on the type of arthritis and the severity of the condition, you know, um, it's where you're going to have the pain, you know, the pain can worsen by the activity, you know, that you do in your daily life, you know, um, it corresponds with the activity that you that we do in our daily lives, you know, and it can worsen, you know, it can worsen our moods. You know, it can, you know, the change of weather can, you know, um, affect it. You know what I mean? Um, that's when you know when, you know, you, somebody says, man, it's rain. I can tell rain's coming, you know. That's because that arthritis setting in and they joints where they feel it, you know, that moisture in the air, you know, that moisture, man. You know, um, it, it's really serious, you know. I get it in my arm. I got it in my arm, you know. But I keep. I use CBD as 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 Doc stated, you know, to help to help it, and and it works, you know. Um, we'll get into more of that at the end, you know. 
let's go on, man. Uh, number two is joint swelling. You know, swelling of the joints occur in, may, in many conditions, but most common is arthritis, you know. The second common is injury. You know, you can, you know, get an injury, you know, and, you know, arthritis can set in through that, you know, or, or most likely the injury most likely um, um, can be due to an, or, an infection or gout, you know, um, if you have gout, man, that's, you know, it's a serious little infection, man, where, you know, you want to try to get rid of that as quick as possible, you know, and it's very painful, I heard, too. You know, um, some lab tests can be performed by checking blood while others require a sample of joint fluid within itself. And that's just like, you know, sticking a needle in, in, in between that joint, guys. And I, I, just, I just thinking of that is painful just thinking about it, you know, so they can draw some fluid from in between your joint, you know, so they can run a test on it, you know. You know, that, that sounds painful within itself, guys. You know, how many people have gone through that, you know, that you know, you know, maybe they can be informed and maybe they got the symptoms of arthritis and they don't even know it, you know. Um, gout, that's a that's another issue. We're going to talk about that, too, because I was reading today a little bit about that. And, you know, we're going to touch a lot of, lot of different subjects, you know, people deal with every day. You know, gout is no joke. You know, um, a lot of people get it from, you know, you know, their feet being a wet a lot, too, I heard, too, you know, or is that something different? Am I thinking about it? It might be, but I'm going to do some more research on that. And he says it's painful. Yeah, yeah. Very painful. Very painful, man. Um, stiff, stiffness of the joints within itself where you can't move, guys. It's like. You know, sometimes I get it, man. Maybe I, I sleep on my arm wrong or something, but I know I got arthritis in there. You know what I'm saying? I feel it. But like I said, CBD takes it away, you know, takes a lot of it away. You know, um, you order some for your pops, doc, that's what's up, man. That's He going to love you for that, man. He going to love you for that. Once he starts getting it in his system and opening up his endocannabinoid system, he going to love you for that, man. He, he going to be pain free. He's going to start feeling relief, you know, and that's what it's all about, man. Feeling relief from that, you know, um, stiffness of the joints. Um, you can compare the joint motion, you know, by, um, um, like, uh, uh, what would I say? You compare that joint motion by, um, comparing it to the other side of stiffness, you know, like if you um if you got if you feel it back here, should I say? Like I feel stiffness back there. You know what I'm saying? You can compare that joint motion to the other side. It usually happens in the morning. It's worse in the morning or after uh uh, long periods of being in one position, you know, so the joint, you know, it moves, you know what I'm saying? That, you know, it hurts, believe me, it hurts in the morning mainly, you know what I'm saying? And that's because I, I, I probably sleep on it wrong. It usually loosens up, you know, as the day it goes on and I, I work it out more, you know, and like I said, I put, put some cream on it, you know, some uh, CBD with uh, emu oil actually i use um or you can use heat a heat compress usually loosens it up you know um or a, a, a application of some anti-inflammatory medication you know or supplements you know um that will relieve it um let's talk about deformity of the joints guys you know um as, as, as deformity of the joints is as a joint and cartilage is worn away by arthritis, the extremity may take on a deformed appearance. So some people might be like like this or something. You might see somebody with with a crooked finger, might have all the rest of them, but you know, in that joint, you know what I'm saying? The appearance looks like, you know, 
just like a, a, a it's like a, a, a tread tires worn off of a, worn off of a car. You know, the cartilage is worn down, just like that. You know, um, it may take on a uh, angled appearance. Like I said, it might take on an angled appearance. You know, um, often hands look crooked or fingers or knee joints, you know, maybe look, develop a little bowness to them, or you may look a little knock needed, you know what I'm saying? From, from it, you know, from the arthritis setting in your joints, you know, um, that's painful enough guys, um, within itself, you know, to have that, you know, deterioration of your muscles and your bones, you know, wearing down, you know, it's, you know, it's painful, guys. It's really painful. Um, I know a lot of you people, you know, it's dealing with arthritis. Are they getting relief today? Yes. Yes, they are getting the relief that they need. Um, like I said, it doesn't work for everybody, but it may work for you. You just have to give it a try, you know, um, I, I encourage every anybody to talk to their doctors, you know, before they even try any supplement or any any uh, anything, you know, to do with supplements. You know, talk to your doctor first. You know, that's the main thing, guys. Um, let's go into number five: the the grinding sensation. And you know, as a joint and cartilage is worn away, the smooth lining covering of the rough bone is lost. You know, so that smooth lining of the, the covering of that bone is lost that rough, you know, it's lost through that, you know, um, when the bone is exposed, the joint may feel or even hear a grinding sensation. So when I move my shoulder, I, I hear a ticking in there. I hear a little click in there and a little click. I got arthritis in there because that's my, my bone, my cartilage wearing away. It's wearing down. Will I need surgery? I don't know. Have I consulted about it? No, I have. What have I been doing? CBD. CBD has been taken it away. Okay. Um, you can place your hand over a joint and you can feel it, you know, with your range of motion. I mean, you can test out your joints to see if you got that, that, you know, that, that sound. I definitely have that sound in my shoulder. So, I know I have it within my shoulder here, you know. Um, like I said, it can it can vary from each person, you know, um, the different sensations of pain, you know. Um, lumps and bumps around the joints, guys. Arthritis can cause a formation of pockets of fluid, you know, um, mucus cysts or bone spurs that they call them. You know, um, they, they feel like knobby. They're, they're knobby -ish, you know, it's like real knobby -ish, you know, bigger lump on top. Maybe this is my joint right here. So maybe a bigger, bigger lump on, 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 the, on the joint where, you know, um, the bone, it, it's a bone spur in there almost like it feels, you know. If you guys ever had a bone spur, boy, those hurt, man. Those hurt. Even when, it, if you had a dentist, you get bone spurs sometime, you know, from them pulling your teeth out. You know what I'm saying? Um, um, let me see. The uh, small, uh, the pain, Tanya Lloyd, Irvin, how you doing? Glad you're here. Tanya, how you doing? Um, glad you joined us here at CBD Talk Live. Um, it, could, it could go into your fingers, you know, where, it, you know, but it doesn't just happen. It can just happen throughout your whole body. You get arthritis. You know, I've heard people getting arthritis throughout their body from their, from their neck down. You know, it's like, how do you control that? You know, um, if anybody had arthritis in your family, man, you, you know, you know, joint tenderness, you know, your, your joints that, that are arthritic are tender to touch. If one side of the joint is more involved with arthritis than the other, um, the other side, um, you usually feel more tenderness, you know, pressing around that joint, you know. Um, like I said, I've had arthritis before. I've 
had a, a sign of arthritis before I left New York to Florida. And, you know, it was getting into my hands, you know. Um, but when I went to Florida, it took a little while for me to, the heat to set in and the temperature of the weather, you know, set in where, you know, it went away. It actually went away in my hands where, you know, I've had, I had full use in them. And now being back in New York, you know, I feel a little bit in my shoulder more, you know, now than I did before, you know, and that's probably the only area that's really messing with me, you know, the most is my shoulder. But like I said, I take CBD, and, you know, I vape. Pretty much takes the anxiety away or whatever, you know, pain, you know, it goes right to the area, you know, so, you know, I do that. So, you know, um, joint tenderness is no joke, man, when you're, you know, when it becomes inflamed, you don't want to touch it, you know? And if you know what I have ever had arthritis, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? That 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 is no no do joke. Um, if you if if you find that you are limiting your activities or unhappy on uh, managing your symptoms of arthritis, consult your doctor, guys. You know, consult it. If it gets too too painful, where you can't even cope with it anymore or anything consult your physician you know talk to him you know um seek out an orth orthopedic surgeon you know just seeking out an orthopedic surgeon doesn't mean that you know necessarily you gotta have surgery you know they're they, they're gonna give you um the best available treatments you know for your arthritic symptoms you know you know um has anybody ever dealt with arthritis besides, you know, doc, docs, you know, just give me a thumb.